the wreckage of the bus that was involved in an accident last night. The journey of 25 people ended at this port in Kambu in Makweni County. The ill-fated bus was hit by an oil tanker which made the driver lose control. The bus then landed in a ditch. The passengers were traveling to Mombasa from Nairobi and the lorry's driver and his tout were heading to Nairobi. Walikuwa watu ishirini. Wale walikupa hapo hapo. Sasa wale wengine walianza kukupa wakati sasa tukumuangua hile mabati vila wale mefinywa. Uh, the bus had a, a, a tire burst uh, as it was trying to overtake. And uh, as a result, uh, as a result, uh, there was a collision with a, a tanga. Kapiringika, kapenduka, kaangalia mahali penye tulikuwa tunatoka. Na hiyo gari tuna watu walikuwa narukia kwa matirisha. Vile lipiringika ikalalia huko, ikalalia watu. Lafu wengine nyo walikuwa ndani, walikuwa naumia tumo ndani. Na sisi wenye tulikuwa tumekiti kwa viti ya nyuma. Tulijikuta tutu kwa inje kwa hiyo itirisha ya nyuma inje na kwanga ya kiyoi. Imeturusha inje. Twelve people are currently receiving treatment at Makindu Subcounty Hospital and Kibwezi Amref Hospital. Wow, Makweni Governor Kivutha Kibwana visited the accident victims and pledged to cover their hospital bills. Mimi kwangu nilianguka, nikafundika mkono, nikakongwa kichwa, nikawarusha tena mkono ingine. Even though they don't come from Makweni, we will not charge them. We will waive uh, the postmortem fees and the mortuary fees, and even for those who are being treated, uh, apart from if they need specialized, uh, any specialized uh, uh, materials, but for ordinary treatment, uh, including even theatre, we shall also waive uh, those charges. According to police officers, the bus driver was overtaking another lorry at Kalulu Bridge before he was hit by the oil tanker. The two drivers are still alive, though the bus driver hasn't been traced. The lorry driver is among the injured being treated at Makindu. Sharon Baranga, NTV.